What's up guys, go back to a brand new video man. Today we have some news about WWE 2K24 and 2K might cut ties with WWE to go to EA Sports. So let's dive straight into this. This is a brand new article, a couple new articles that dropped so let's check it out man. Uh, WWE took two cut ties with 2K after WWE 2K24 in favor of EA Sports. Exploring gestures okay the recent report suggests WWE is taking major steps regarding WWE games WWE 2k24 could be the last game of the 2k games banner so what they're saying is basically 2k24 could be the last 2k game and that ea sports is taking over for 2k25 um 2K games have been WWE's gaming partner for almost a decade now. 2K's first major title was WWE 2K14, released in 2013. 2K14 was a fantastic game as well, man, 100%. And the most recent addition in the gaming franchise is WWE 2K23, launched this year in March. 2K games recently uh, releases WWE games almost every year, featuring updated mo uh, modes, superstars, arenas, and more. Yes, they do. They do that all the time. Well, not updated. Uh, superstars, but you get what I'm saying. According to previous reports, 2K Games is set to release the next Halo title in the 2K series, WWE 2K24, with the first major announcement dropping at the Royal Rumble 2024, okay? Which is very, very interesting that they put that out there, alright? Can we get ready these ads? Uh, I can't. Alright, um, a recent report by XO News suggests that WWE and Endeavor Group, the new par uh, parent company of WWE, are planning to serve ties with 2K Games after almost 10 years long. They are considering considering signing a deal with EA Sports, the same company that produces games uh, for UFC, the partner company of WWE under TKO Group's banner. If WWE cuts ties with 2K Games, WWE 24 could be the 10th and final installment produced by 2K Games. Um. Major superstars to make a return in the game. The best in the world, CM Punk made his return to WWE after almost 10 long years at Survivor Series War, Ga War Games 2023. He last wrestled in WWE at Royal Rumble 2014 and was last featured in WWE Games in WWE 2015. Which was released back in 2014. Um, he also says this. Punk was also part of the showcase mode of that game. Following his return, WWE and gaming fans anticipate his comeback to the game landscape. A previous report by XO News expressed that CM Punk returned to the go WWE games this year. Similarly to Cody Rhodes being featured in WWE 2K13 last year, WWE could feature him as double content for the game just like they did with Bray Wyatt. Alright, so... WWE 2K, man. 2K24 could be its last, um, you know what I'm saying, installment because EA Sports, it's like EA Sports is taking over. Um, I don't know if they are going to take over, but that's what it, it seems like, you know what I'm saying? It seems like they are taking over just because uh, they side with Endeavor and Endeavor wants EA Sports and with UFC. So it kind of makes sense. It all ties together, you know what I'm saying? It kind of makes sense. Now, with EA Sports taking over, it just could be one to two things, you know what I'm saying? Um, that A, I think EA Sports is better than 2K games sometimes with the graphic and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it just makes sense, you know what I'm saying? It may also makes sense that Endeavor is with e UFC. UFC is with EA Sports, you know what I'm saying? But uh, here's another article, okay? I didn't, haven't seen this one yet. WK 24 cover started three days that could likely end up as a face of upcoming game. Possibilities for the top three days that could grace this year's 2K24 cover and showcase and the detailed reason behind their names and lists. Um, 2K Games is officially part, game part of WWE, has been producing games for the, the wrestling organization. Um, for almost a decade now. The original WWE game, WK14, was followed by the latest edition, WK23, which was released on March 14, 2023. Each year, 2K Games releases a new WWE game featuring updated rosters, new features, and digital game modes. Last year, WWE introduced major match types like War Games and added um, new readers such as Clash of the Castle, WrestleMania 38, and more. A significant annual update in the game and franchise revolves around the cover star, superstar, and the showcase star. Last year, players had the opportunity to revisit the iconic career of John Cena, who also graced the cover of the 2K23 series. Look ahead, there are possibly the top three names who could grace the cover this year's uh, Brothers and Bray Wyatt and Cody Rhodes. The reason why these stars are likely to be cover stars of WK24, Brock Lesnar has the cover star of WK24. Brock Lesnar, the former WWE champion, undoubtedly stands at the biggest name in the company. Mostly a high level success run behind dominate the world of pro wrestling. Lesnar made his 
the history by becoming the first WWE champion to also claim the UFC title. Okay, that was pretty cool. With rumors story about his potential retirement, WWE 2K24 could pay tribute. Uh, let's see, pay tribute. I just lost my whole thing to Brock Lesnar, which is pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Um, also, it says here, report WK24 is reportedly going to be a dedication to the career of Bray Wyatt. This is obviously making the focus of the showcase mode and cover of Bray Wyatt on 2K24, um, which is very, very interesting. Also, they say Cody Rhodes, okay? But, um, Brian Lesnar is a former WWE champion, undoubtedly stands as the biggest name uh, in the company, boosting, let me get rid of this ad real quick. Uh, boosting and highly successful run behind dominating the world of pro wrestling. Lesnar made history by becoming the first WWE champion to also claim the UFC title with rumors throwing around his potential retirement. WWE 24 could pay tribute to this living legend by featuring his iconic career as a showcase in the game and placing him on the cover, which is 100%. Uh, Bray Wyatt as the cover star of WWE 24 is for Bray Wyatt. The WWE star and former champion tragically passed away this year, saying shockwaves throughout the world of pro wrestling, recognized as one of the best in the industry. Wyatt had a brief but info impactful run in WWE. Face off against top names like The Undertaker, John Cena, and Roman Reigns. WWE 24 could honor Wyatt's legacy by featuring him as a cover star, providing fans with a chance to revisit his iconic career and offering the best tribute to the late wrestler. Cody Rhodes at the cover star for 2K24. On the other hand, the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes recently made his triumphant return to the WWE at WrestleMania 38. He's a strong contender for the cover of WWE 2K24. A fan favorite, reportedly the highest merchandise seller of the year. Rhodes is particularly popular among the younger audience, allowing well the 2K games made market. With rumors circling about Rhodes potentially winning WWE Universal Championship from Roman Reigns, he emerges as a heavy favorite for this year's game cover. Brock Lesnar, Bray Wyatt, and Cody Rhodes are the top options for this year's cover star of WWE 2K24. Okay, so what do you guys think, man? Who do you guys see that as a cover star this year? I did a video on The Rock. I did a video on CM Punk. Uh, there's rumors going around that Brock Lesnar could be on the cover. There's rumors going around that Bray Wyatt has a special edition. Uh, Cody Rhodes could be on the cover as well. You know what I'm saying? Well, let me know in the comments down below. Also, let me know if you guys think EA Sports taking over is the right move or you want 2K to stay. Well, you want WWE to stay with 2K or EA Sports, comment that down below as well. Uh, just let me know, man. I always read the comments. I always reply to the comments. The comments are always a good thing. Uh, also, drop a like on the video. It helps out the video as well. Make sure you guys follow my TikTok. I'll put my TikTok link in the description of the video. And I'll put it at the comment, man. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Again, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Drop a like on the video. Turn on your post notifications. Because if you turn on your post notifications, you'll be notified every time I drop a video. And I'll see you guys next time man peace